deaths uh, and fraudulent deaths that happened uh, in Mozambique uh, have triggered an economic and social crisis. The first thing that happened was a budget suspension, uh, a support of budgets uh, from the donors mm -hmm. that used to support the state budget. In that context, um, the investment, the public investment that used to be done by the state with, uh, with this support has, has reduced uh, very much. Um, the econo economy, the foreign domestic investment have reduced a lot. Uh, the private sector have faced um, a very uh, a big crisis given the devaluation of the, the currency uh, and the opportunities for business have reduced and many of them went bankrupt. Um, on social part, uh, as I said before, given the fact that the public uh, investment have reduced, particularly on social services, um, you, you can go to a health clinic today and don't see a single paracetamol in a clinic. Um, the number of uh, schools, the number of, um, of public clinics, the, the, the investment in water and sanitation have also completely reduced, putting a lot of pressure not only on the, the, the public sector itself, but on, also on the lives of, of the already impoverished Mozambican population. Um, uh, the, 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 the living um, conditions also have um, uh, lower, given the fact that the prices of everything have raised. So you had this wave, this I would say the first wave of of, of, of impact uh, of this, this, this death. But you, you will also have a second wave of the impact which is related with the fact that uh, um, we had uh, natural disasters such as the Aidai and uh, the Kenneth cyclone, cyclone which exacerbated the situation. But the, the issue uh, we, I will call the third wave which is uh, the, um, the fact that all these debts were based on the fact that we will have um, an investment, a big uh, revenues from the gas which will come. So the, 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 the money uh, that will come or the resources that will come are already um, linked with the payment, repayment of these debts. So the, this last wave is even more dangerous because it's not just the generation, the existing generation that is uh, uh, affected by the death, but also the new generations will be affected by, by the death.